hello welcome back to my channel today is another day and another vlog again and some of you requested for a grwm or a get ready with me video so here it goes shout out to jade ko one of those people or my subscribers who requested for a GRWM get ready with me here I am now with your get ready video okay so I'm done with um, my sunscreen and my moisturizer now we are going to put on I'm, I think I'm just gonna use a BB cream today. And you know me, I'm not really a heavy makeup person. Not unless it's really cold for, for, then I will. But today, it's just an ordinary day. I'm just gonna go out, mulling. So, I would like to show you this. It's a BB cushion, a Korean BB cushion which I bought in Korea so this is in the shade C23 this is the inside of course you peel this out and that's that's the shade so get the product I don't really use this a lot because I think it is, I mean, lighter than my skin tone. But just to show those um, fellow friends of mine, mommies who are, you know, maybe one thing to buy this product it's a good product actually but it's it's on the pricey side okay so can you see half has the product and other half doesn't have what do you think Well, if it's very light on my skin, I can just do something about it, like after. So, let's just wait. Okay, so it's not really... Um, full coverage because I can still see my imperfections there oh my god it's so white <laughs> and let me just cut it on So how's that? Now we're gonna go to uh, my eyebrows and using my other than my Chanel Duo eyebrows and I'm gonna use the lighter shade brown which I always use Okay, let's apply it on the brows What about you guys? What do you use on your eyebrows? Do you know some something or any product that is um, waterproof? Because I'm still looking for that particular product like waterproof or something that, you know, stays longer. Although... I already have a tattooed eyebrows. I still put on or I still buy 
eyebrow products because yeah now we are going to top off my or just darken my eyeliner tattooed eyeliner upper eyeliner and i'm using this product i don't usually use this this is the chanel um cream eyeliner in hyper black and this is it see i'm just gonna dab this um angled brush lightly to um top of my upper eyeliner winged eyeliner my face looking so light <laughs> I know we're gonna do something about it all right so after this I'm gonna put on a powder so I've been into illuminating powders lately now I found this one, it's from Shantikai and it's the Eclat Duo Face Powder. So this powder is illuminating like there, can you see? So this, I will use powder today and this is what I will use right uh-huh because who doesn't like glow i like glow youthful glow i don't like dull <laughs> i like to glow a simple glow I just need to um, make sure it's all spread out on my face. Do you see the glow, guys? Because I cannot see myself in the cam, so it's up to you to judge. But yes, this is an illuminating powder. To those who are looking for an illuminating powder without the sparkles, this is just like um like a shine without the sparkle. Okay. And now I'm gonna go to yes the favorite or the best friend who among you has an addiction for this me I'm not really addicted to you know curling my lashes I can go out without curling my lashes Okay, let's put on just a little bit of mascara and I'm using the Chanel in number 10 I don't know I cannot read because I don't have my reading glasses so I'm gonna put on a little bit of mascara just on the uh, base of my lashes or where my lashes grows So 
So me guys, I don't like long lashes. I don't like my lashes to be long. I I just want it to be uh, full or thick. So yes, just thick and not really long because you know I'm I'm wearing eyeglasses. So every time I wear eyeglasses, if I make it like longer, it always um, hits my eyeglasses or it my lashes always tends to um touch my eyeglasses which can be very annoying for me so yeah i just keep my eyelashes um as is but thicker and that's it i'm not gonna put on any eyeshadow today i am okay with just the winged liner and of course yes my addiction um, blush so last time I showed you a different blush my also one of my favorite the YSL duo um, blush stick blush which is this but this time I will be using another um, favorite of mine which is the this one it's well, it's already broken as you can see because it's been with me for um, how many years now and I broke it. It's the Givenchy um, Chic or Chic Fabric Sheer Blush in Eccentrical. It's already fading because it's been with me for a long time now. And I think they've already discontinued this particular um, product. And this is the shade. I really like it because when I apply it on my cheek, it just looks like, you know, naturally flushed or blushing cheek. So now I'm gonna use my Hello Kitty brush and I will just dab this here there and of course I will be doing my usual um Drunk blush Drunk blush style This this is what looks good on me If anybody of you asking why I apply some why I apply like this But this is what you call drunk blush look And I simply like this because it looks natural. It looks like uh, I'm blushing. Let's put a little bit here. Okay, so that is the drunk blush. <laughs> and sometimes I tend to go crazy with this because it will just lighten up after a few minutes. And I will just blend it after. Okay, so does it look like crazy?
and then let's apply lip balm so i'm using my um la mer lip balm For me, this is a very good lip balm because I have a lot of lip balms. I've tried a lot of lip balms, drugstore lip balms, and it did not help with uh, my lips dryness. But this one, yeah, it's pricey, but I swear, this works. So, my search for lip balms already ended because before i keep on buying and buying spending and spending for lip balms all drugstore lip balms nothing really helped at least now yes i found a and i'm happy well even if it's pricey i think i can use this for how many years I still have a lot there. So now, um, let's put on whatever lipstick. I think I'm not gonna apply a lipstick. I will just apply this. Um, I have this lip balm. Which I cannot read. <laughs> But it's the Sulwasu. Can you see the name there? It says Sulwasu and it's the number 7. It's like a lip balm. But it has this shade. So it's a lip balm. And then, to add a little bit of glow, even if I am already glowing, <laughs> I will still use this, uh, sh this is the Chanel, um, I don't know, it's the Chanel Balm, Glow Balm. <laughs> So I'm just gonna dab my finger here and then apply here to give me a little glow there. And here. And here. No disclaimer, I'm not a professional makeup artist, okay? I'm only doing this. And this is my um what i do what i put on my face what i do to my face i'm not claiming that a that i am a professional makeup artist because i am not by any means <laughs> And also, this video is not sponsored. All these products are mine, purchased with my own money. There's no sponsorship, 
and I am not yet affiliated with the said products for now <laughs> okay so that's the final step and then I think I will just of course um, spray with this is a um, glow luminous flower sun spray SPF 50 since I'm going out this is also a Korean brand Korean product so let's try it on that's my look for today my friends how do you like it just a simple glowy makeup for over 40 close to 50 women so that's it for now my friends to those who are new to my channel please don't forget to subscribe and please don't forget to tick the bell notification for my future videos and of course to my friends already thank you so much again for watching my video and i hope to see you again in the next one bye much love from angel